for suspects in a shooting at a Manhattan music studio. Let's get right to CBS 2's Elijah Westbrook, live in Midtown. Elijah? Well, Cindy, I can tell you at this hour, details are still slim coming from police, but I can also tell you that throughout the morning, we've been watching uh, detectives go in and out of this building you see here uh, behind me. That is where a 26-year-old man was shot in the head at least once. Go ahead and take a look at video we were able to gather shortly after all of this went down. You can see the crime scene there. Police say the shooting occurred inside of a music studio between midnight and 1 a.m. Now, we've been checking out surveillance video throughout the area, and in some of it, you can can see a group of people quickly walking out of the building around the time this incident happened. Now, police say they are looking for four men. One of them, officers say, is likely in his 20s. A clear description of him and the three others remains quite vague. Now, the 26-year-old victim is recovering at Bellevue Hospital. At last check, he's in critical condition. Now, we just spoke with two men who work in this area, and let's take a listen to what they had to say about all this. 8th Avenue is out of control. I'm always, um, always been out of control, yeah. especially at night. It's a zoo. Never know what you'll get on 8th Avenue. That's just, honestly. Yes. So when we walk into this building, we just know to, it's always something going down. Yeah, I mean, if you notice, over the last year, there's been a lot more crime here, too, as well. It's becoming a lot, a lot more consistent. Now, we've learned this place is called the Music Building. It's, in fact, a pretty prominent spot for musicians to record and rehearse. On its website, it says people like Madonna, Blondie, Billy Idol, and Metallica have recorded music here in the early parts of their career. Now, back out here live, aside from that, the investigation is ongoing at this point. Police are urging folks to give them a call if they know anything thing about this case and we are live this morning from midtown manhattan elijah westbrook cbs 2 news elijah thank you